Um, <laughs> so this is a story about the owner of a DVD rental store in a place called Limerick. That's a city in Ireland, right? And uh, for the last six years, there's been a local priest from the Vatican that's been calling in for customer service and to rent movies at the store. Look at this. I just, eating grin on this I just know face. where the story is going because I read it. He loves it. So uh, back in January, uh, this priest from the Vatican that calls the video store, he kept mentioning that he had watched Lincoln. And he was giving sort of an anecdotal review about the movie. And uh, he said that, you know, he had watched it in, a, in the monastery the night before and that they had gotten the movie and they had watched it in sort of a film club inside the Vatican. The problem is that at the time in January, Lincoln wasn't out on DVD yet. Yep. <laughs> right? So uh, this film guy, the, the guy that owned the video store, suspected that the priest had pirated this movie in some way. Priests right? pirating movies. What else? Weird. <laughs> what right? else will this world turn to? It's the same thing for other movies, because he had mentioned others too, like Django Unchained, <laughs> Les Miserables, and Zero Dark Thirty, all of which hadn't gotten out on DVD yet. It's weird how right? they shot it, because it was like a handheld camera in a yeah. movie theater, and I thought it would be shot more professionally than <laughs> right. that. Right, and they didn't take a trip to the movies. They actually watched this inside the monastery. So what we have here is basically a, an illegal DVD download ring what's, of priests. What's one of those... Oh, it was a commandment, thou shall not steal. It's weird, right? Bunch of priests that don't know the difference between right and wrong, what's legal, what's illegal. So weird. Never heard of anything like that before. So Torrent Freak decided to do a little bit more research, and uh, they, they took a look at some of the downloading habits within the Vatican itself. This is crazy. So it's, the Vatican is really small. It's a small part of the city, so it's easy to track what torrents are coming based in and out. Based on IP. Based on IP addresses. Like they noticed that one IP address kept coming up. They released a list of the things that are being watched inside the Vatican right now. And this the is list crazy. is comprised of everything you would expect someone to download from BitTorrent, right? So TV shows, let's start with the clean stuff. TV shows are really popular in the Vatican. Um, ironically enough, The Americans is, is one of the most downloaded. Interesting. Right? Uh, one of, uh, only three Hollywood movies appear in the list. Love Actually, Awe, <laughs> a cam copy of Snitch, and then The Last Stand. That's the Wolverine movie, right? Ah, uh, I, think. I don't know. The Last Stand. Yeah. yeah, oh, okay. Didn't download any music. No. Priests hate music. They hate music. Dot com. No, are it, we sure that someone's not spoofing? Could be. Someone could have been spoofing it, but listen to this. Apparently someone within the Vatican has also been downloading adult material. No. That's not surprising. I've right? never Everyone heard of any porn. controversy with, with sexual behavior and the Vatican. This is the I've first never heard time. Of that. You heard it first on the floor. <laughs> We're breaking, We're breaking it right it. now. <laughs> Apparently priests are human too. They downloaded one title and it was only labeled RSS Episode 1. Okay. Right? That could mean anything. Sure. But it only means one thing because I did the research for it. And RSS Episode 1, it's a video of two ladies... Kidnapped in a Russian BDSM club. Oh my god. And this exists within the BDSM slash punishment category of BitTorrent in their servers, right? And then there's also other videos that are downloaded featuring such starlets as Tiffany Star, Sheena Shaw, Leia Lexus, and Chrissy Lynn, of which I viewed all of their repertoires over the weekend. Yeah, and yes, they are adult actors. Yeah, yeah they uh -huh. all they do they do engage in adult activity hmm. in these videos. So isn't that crazy? I mean, they, they have all this porn downloaded. And you're right, it could be an IP spoofing thing, and that's what the controversy is all about. Why but, isn't this getting picked up? And But what incentive would ha anyone have to spoof this IP address, not knowing that... To the, make it look like the Vatican's downloading porn. Yeah, but they didn't know that this video store guy... It would have to be some kind of sting operation, right? Like, right. Without and look, being prompted, why would they do that? I mean, it's a little... And you would imagine... I don't know, the Vatican has some sort of internet security in place to prevent something like this from happening. Mm -hmm. Right? You it, would, you, yeah. one would, one would think. You think this is like a Vatican IT guy? It's a <laughs> firewall <laughs> run by God. Yeah.